Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So yes, it is that time again. Time to take up another champion. And if you think you can guess who I'm about to take up now, leave a comment below. Let me know what your guess is. But we're about to reveal it in five, four, three, two, one, toe. So I know a lot of you probably already guessed that because I just got him. And so, of course, I want to take him up. Now, you're seeing this video Monday morning. I was going to instead mix it up because I have other rank ups that I could do. Uh, and I also thought about making a crystal opening video, which I could also do. But I was like, you know what? Let's just go ahead and make this rank up for Toad. Um, I was tired of trying to hide him for one thing. And I saw some really nice stuff about Toad. I don't know yet whether he's much better awakened or not. Um, but he seems to be pretty good. Now, I've not added him to my deck yet. But I will for Battlegrounds. Um but I definitely wanted to take him up and I did a lot of stuff to uh, get the materials to rank him up. And at the time of this recording, there's a second level up that's going on right now. I leveled him up last level up. So this level up, um, I have, I believe, two more rank ups that I've done. but. We're going to see how good Toad is. And I've seen some very interesting mechanics that I don't quite understand yet, but I will. And one thing that I found interesting is that for map eight, the final boss on the uh, right hand side is Toad. Usually, if Kabam does that, there's a reason. There's a reason that they make that particular champion the boss. Now, I saw him do something along the lines of shutting down certain abilities, you know, and I wasn't sure. Like, I saw him um, fighting Hercules, but I don't know whether it was the Assassin Mastery, which can um, cause Hercules' immortality to fail as well, or if it was something in his kit that caused that to happen. So I have to find that out. And if you guys know, leave a comment below because I'm in learn mode right now. All right, so even, uh, hold on, let me take a look something here. Okay, so even uh, when we go into uh, Realm of Legends, bear in mind that I don't know how to use him I don't know any special rotations for him, nothing. I've seen that his uh, special two uh, does a lot of damage. Uh, and I see that his special one can do some uh, nasty damage too. But that's about it. And actually, at this point in time, I don't remember what his special three looks like. So when we go into Realm of Legends, I'm going to make sure to fire off his special three so that I could actually see it. You know, I seen his special one and two, but I don't remember what his special three looks like. So I may or may not have ever seen it. Uh, so we, we'll see, we'll see how that goes. Um, but anyway, uh, let's, uh, without further ado, head into Realm of Legends. And like I said, we're gonna just showcase his specials and take a look at his damage and that sort of thing, all right? So we'll be right back. So I was looking over his synergies and I threw together these synergies, ones that, that look like they would increase his damage in some way, shape or form. So let's check this out. All right. So this first one here, take a look at this tongue attacks that make contact deal 20% of attack as a burst of physical damage while paralytic secretion is active. That looks good. Next one. Special attacks have plus 15 crit rating while paralytic secretion is active. That looks good. 
plus 8% poison debuff potency. That looks good too. And finally, 30% chance to inflict a non-stacking disorient debuff, reducing defensive ability accuracy and block proficiency for 8 seconds. By 50% for 8 seconds when a poison expires. Having the block proficiency down that much means he's going to do a lot more damage. All right. So, like I said, I don't really know how best to use him, but I'm very curious to see. Um, let me turn this down a little bit. Uh, I'm very curious to see what he is like here. Okay. Paralytic poisons. Okay. I saw him purifying some stuff. Why is he purifying? He doesn't usually purify. I'm talking about Winter Soldier. Alright, so that was a special one. Damage is not bad. I know I'm not using him uh, the way he should be used. I'm about to hit him with a special two. Okay. And then I'm gonna work my way up to a special three. But I guess his damage is not that bad. And once I learn a little bit better how to play him, it's gonna be on. Is that a slow? Hold on. Ah. Paralytic poison. Paralytic poison. Yeah, it is a slow. Wow. Okay. All right, let's hit him with a special three. See what this looks like. Okay, I know I didn't see that before. So he puts a slow also on them. Mm. So he's not just damage, he's got utility as well. Interesting. Right, let's hit him with another special uh, two. Let me get a, a heavy in here. I have no idea whether that is a good thing to do or not. Let's do a special one. I see a, a regen buff on. And I remember fighting him and, and getting like stacks and stacks of his regen. I love that stun too. Huh. Yeah. I got to learn him. I got to learn him. Uh, let me see what, what it looks like with a poison immune champion if he goes up against them. I'm curious because, you know, with um, some champions like I-Bomb. Okay, no, nah, he's immune. Um, even though they might be poison immune, you hit that special two. And they're going to still take damage from his uh, acid burn. But looks like that might not be the case here. Let's, because uh, I don't see any of the paralytic uh, poisons on. Let's hit her with a special three. Even though she's poison immune, I mean, damage is not completely horrible but yeah I would not bring him in uh, to a fight against a poison immune unless I'm just doing this wrong it looks like that is not a good matchup for him with I bomb I could still do it if I needed to but it is not looking like that is the case for him. 
Let me try a special two here. Just want to see if there's any. Nope. Yeah. Let's, um. Yeah, because I'm not trying to. Yeah, I'm not trying to do that fight. Uh, but anyway, uh, that's going to do it. Uh, I like Toad. It looks like he's got some utility as well. See, paralytic secretion, passive, slowly regenerates. Okay, so the paralytic secretion is on him, not them. So while that's going, okay. See, I got. I'm, I'm learning. I, I like to learn as I'm, I'm doing this, um, since I don't do those videos like I used to. Um, but I'm liking him, and I know that I'm gonna learn him a little bit better. But yeah, looks like. I mean. She's poison immune, but look, you know, she, he's not doing terribly. You know, she's almost down to half her health. So she he can definitely do this fight. You know, I just wouldn't necessarily bring him against uh, someone who's poison immune. That's all. Uh, but anyway, that's going to do it. Thank you all for watching. Take care. Hopefully I will see you guys a little bit later on the live stream. All right. Take care. And you all have a... Blessed day.